everyone this is scott doing another video this time for this um, eva naturals skin clearing serum so i saw it on amazon and uh, there were a lot of great reviews um it's kind of pricey i think it's about over twenty dollars for this small bottle um and the worst thing was uh, as i was using it one day i i didn't cap it fully and it just spilled half of it into the sink which really sucks Anyways, as you can see, it's made of vitamin C. It's a vitamin C serum. It's got 2% salic, sal, actually salicylic acid and a 5% hyaluronic acid and a 3.5% niacinamide, 2% uh, retinol, 10% MSM. I have no idea what that stuff are other than vitamin C and the acid. Uh, the ingredients are here. Um, I have no idea what any of this stuff is, so no point trying, me to, trying for me to read it out. It's not tested on animals. It's made in the USA, and here's their website. So the directions are to wash face, then dry, apply a small amount to your entire face, neck, and uh, the colette. I don't know what the hell is the colette. Allow to dry, follow with a moisturizer. So I've been using this on my face. I have a lot of acne on my face. I'm uh, 40 plus years old. Uh, I have tr I've used Accutane in the past and uh, I've tried um, antibiotics recently to get rid of my acne and that worked very well. But the problem is I didn't want to continue the antibiotics. So I was looking on Amazon for something that was natural that I could, not natural, but something that I could try that doesn't involve uh, swallowing some pills. Um, I'm not sure if this is like healthier or anything, but um, I thought we'd try it out. Here's what it looks like. It's like a milky kind of substance uh, looking kind of thing. It has a pretty good smell actually. You know, it, it reminds me of... Um, what does it remind me of? Um, retinol, I guess. Smells like retin. I've used retinol uh, creams before for my doctor. Anyways, um, it's very easy to apply. I usually use my finger. I put it on a little cup, a tiny little plastic cup, and I um, use my fingers and apply it on my face. And I also apply it on my scalp actually as well, because um, I do have a lot of acne on my scalp for some reason. If anybody have any experience with scalp acne and have any solutions, let me know. Uh, but nothing I've tried really worked. I've tried the, um, what, is it, what is it, the benzoyl peroxide stuff. Uh, and, I mean, it didn't really work very well, uh, but this stuff actually did better. I'm not saying it solved it, but it really made a huge improvement within a matter of days. So I was kind of very happy with that. And for my face, I feel like it, did make an improvement in a matter of days, um, but not a huge. I still have acne though. Um, didn't really get rid of it. Maybe it got rid of it. Uh, I mean, it, it it didn't form a cyst, which which is good. It didn't go to the level of being a cyst. Sometimes my acne would uh, grow into a cyst, and that was horrible. But now with this stuff, at least it's a little bit more manageable. Uh, I still have the redness. I still have the pimples. But I don't have the um, the whiteheads that come out, uh, and uh, I don't have those uh, huge cysts. So I think it helps. I'm not saying it solves everything, but it does help, and uh, it doesn't really irritate my skin too much. I feel a little bit of uh, irritation on my skin after I apply it, and also on my scalp when I apply it. But it's nothing that I can't. Um, I mean, it's nothing serious from a scale of one to ten. Maybe it's like a two in terms of irritation uh didn't really cause my face to go red or anything i apply it and then i go to work even so um hopefully my coworkers don't notice anyways um i do recommend it i'll put a link below my review so you can uh, go there and purchase it um like i said it's a little bit expensive um but uh, i thought we'd give it a try uh again um this is Scotty Treehouse. Uh, I do uh, reviews of products that I purchased myself. Uh, most of my products were from Amazon, uh, but uh, if anyone would like me to review their product, I'm happy to 
check it out and give my honest feedback. So I will give my honest feedback. Anyways, you can contact me at scottytreehouse at gmail or um, find me on Twitter. So subscribe and uh, let me know what you think, especially about the scalp acne, if anyone has any experience with it. Talk to you later. Bye.